everybody what's up it's kiki and i am coming at you guys today finally with an update on this hair you guys were like kiki what happened to the hair um the mongolian kiki straight from princess hair shop was it bad what happened to it why didn't you wear it well because like i told you guys when i first made the unit i am used to closure wigs now like i really can't do a style with my hair being left out like the v part fit good it laid good my hair blended so well but I just couldn't do it. I, I wanted all my hair braided up. I wanted to jump up in the morning, grab a wig, throw it on, and that was it. I didn't want to have to blend my hair or do anything to my natural hair. So, Princess Hair Shop was out of stock on the Mongolian Kiki Straight closures. So, I waited till they got one. Got one, and then I attached the closure to my head. So, that's what I did. That's what happened to the hair. It's not bad. I didn't have any issues with the hair. The hair is still very free-flowing and gorgeous it does match with my hair but i just did not feel like dealing with my own hair like once you start wearing closure wigs it's hard to go back to wearing u part v parts or even sew-ins so that's what happened that's why i wasn't wearing the hair but as you can see all well and good the hair is fine um yeah so i just put a little curved parting in it bleached it and uh, bleached my closure and then attached it so all I did was just cut off the piece that was the invisible V part which is this piece here I cut that and then I cut off like an extra track that I had bonded down or hot glue down then I just attached the closure to the what is the U part then and then I um, applied it to my head <clears throat> I was a little off on measuring so it is a little bit bigger than my normal wigs so I just attached the elastic band, something I never do, but I didn't want to, I didn't feel like remaking my whole wig over or taking the closure down and trying to measure it again. So I, so I just attached an elastic band from one side of the closure to the other to make it fit. So that I didn't have to go through the whole process of deconstructing my wig and then remaking it. I really hate making wigs. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I did. Um, but everything else is perfectly fine so now I have no parts hot glued on my wig it is all sewn down now and like I said before the hair is just gorgeous a nice nice texture I did add a few layers you know just to frame my face and make it lay a little better and if you want to see how I made this wig into the invisible V part I will have that list listed below as well as how I installed it on my head I'll have that link below as well I did shampoo and condition it and it still kept its texture I haven't put a flat iron all the way through it you know to get it bone straight but I do plan on doing flexi rods on it to see how it holds a curl and how it curls so if you guys want to see that please like this video comment below let me know that you guys would like to see me do a flexi rod tutorial on this hair or even a curling tutorial just something so you guys can see how this hair curls and how it holds a curl because I am really loving it in a straight texture or a straight state it looks like naturally relaxed hair so I did want to put some color into it but I know once you color textured hair like this it makes it silkier so I didn't want to do that so I'm just gonna leave it like this where it's looking like my natural hair but I'm definitely gonna put some curls in it just to see how it holds so that's it I just really want to come through and show you guys that no the hair did not turn bad or you know turn into a matte ball or a tangled up mess or anything like that it's just I am so used to closure wigs now that I couldn't do the invisible part the part you part wig any hair being left out was like no can't do it so I just waited on me a closure and that's what happened so um, yeah the closure looks just as natural as the hair it is the same texture so that's not an issue at all I am still loving the hair and I will keep you guys posted on this hair I love you guys and I'll talk to y'all later